guys, nice to meet you. Today I will describe you the AC lab equipment test. Basically you will receive a delivery package with inside other small packages that includes like the lab test cells. Here you have like three different lab test cells. One is with 1A, the other one is with 5A and the last one is with 20A. Okay, basically in the box you will receive also like the pump, the tubes, the cables and also the plates that are in different materials and after we will show you how to connect them together. Now let's start the installation. Of course you need to put the two valves inside the cell and you need to make sure that they are closed. Then of course you continue putting the plates inside the cell. The plates are in different kinds of ways and we have it like in aluminium, iron, SAA and BDD. For AC reaction, AI and iron either can be node or anode. Just keep same for one time and you can switch node or anode for checking which one is better for you. For your reaction, the plate with darker color is the SA plate, which is titanium plates. Then we can connect the cables and you should remember that the red one is positive and the black one is negative. Third, we connect the pump. The test done can do batch reaction and continuous reaction. Batch reaction is when we connect the pump inlet to the circulating valve and pump outlet to the cell inlet valve. Continuous reaction when we pump the wastewater to the inlet valve and the circulating valve are connected to some tanks for discharge. Okay, now let's pour water. Now let's open the valves. First one. Then the second one. Let's turn it on. And then let's put power. So as you can see, you can control the flow with the green bottle depending on how much you put it like to the right or the left. Then when the reaction is finished, we just put the water inside the filtering paper to separate the sludge from water. And if you have any problem during the testing process, feel free to contact us. Thanks for watching.